Hi, this is Miss Blanco bringing you this week's book talk. I am Malala. It's an informational text written by Malala Yousaf Saeed with Christina Lamb. Now this is an autobiography and it's not written in the typical fashion of an autobiography. I mean, you do learn about Malala, her hopes and her dreams, but it is also it also gives historical details about Afghanistan, Pakistan, where Malala lives in Swat, and also about how the Taliban came to rule both countries. And she also gives detailed accounts about how the Taliban impacted her life, especially her goals for gaining an education, and how the Taliban used this as a weapon to oppress them by not educating or allowing the education of women and holding them hostages to their own beliefs. And what, I, what really impressed me about this book is that, as I stated before, it gives historical details, but it also gives political analysis. You can take it as a primary source. And Malala's just so wise for her age. She writes about the day where she learned that her life was being threatened by the Taliban. Then they told me about the call from home and that they were talking, taking the threat seriously. I did not know why, but hearing I was being targeted did not worry me. It seemed to me that everyone knows they will die one day. My feeling was nobody can stop death. It doesn't matter if it comes from a Talib or from cancer. So I should do whatever I want to do. And that just shows you how brave this young lady or young adult really is. And there is one more quote that I would like to read to you that also speaks about her wisdom. But I said, education is education. We should learn everything and then choose which path to follow. Education is neither Eastern nor Western. It is human. And that just really spoke to me, stating the fact that education is a basic human right, that we should all be allowed to be educated, no matter what our background is. So I encourage you to pick up this book and read it. Maybe you can read it to your family, to your kids, to your students, if you're a teacher, because it is a great inspiration.